Ah, uh, it's a wannabe M product. That thing's been there for years. I always see it and see the bumper and think, oh, it's an oh, no, it's that 550. Woman drives it. Guess she works over there. Still a nice car. Just after 11 o'clock here, and I'm high as a kite. Check it out. We're on the third story of a tri-level house here in uh, in the village. There's that thing. Look how dull that paint is. Ew. And uh, it's my job now to come up here and take the blower, which is precariously perched over here, and blow all this crap off because we're going to wash the house down today uh, with the hose, and we don't want to be hitting this stuff and blowing it all over the place. So I'm going to start off with this, blow all this crap off into the yard. We'll pick that up and then get to the side of the house. Oh, hell yeah. Something for the data zoo here. Check that out. Yay! It's the same color as your shirt, bud. I'll make a good wallpaper. It's actually pretty good. Send that to me. Looks really good, Taylor. Good shot. Damn, look at that quality. Damn. <laughs> Guys, look at this. Listen. This is the top part. We filmed them last year and the year before. Colt was here last year. And he left yesterday. And they are <laughs> so good. It's like the Cleveland Orchestra of Hudson, right? No! We'll come back in a minute and film more. They, really they, should, they should play pompous music. I am in the Cleveland Orchestra of Hudson. They but should play pompous music. That, they, that would do well in Hudson. Do good. They're right. They do goodly. Oh, God. Check it out. We got a uh, Sebring over here. Drop top. I told her about the pop Pretty nice cards. car. Yeah, WW Thick Theory. <laughs> hey Taylor, you know what that car is right there? Just left? You know? Not Alex's. Is that Alex? Yep. No. Yep. No. Yes, it is. No. <laughs> no, it's not. Alright, Taylor, here. Take the camera. Yeah, look at all these people lined up to like listen to this shitty music. Not good. This is Hudson for you. Crazy. And I can't press the stop button because my hands are covered in donut grease. Donut grease. Yeah, chugging those donuts. So that thing I can't do anything because my hands are covered with this. With semen. Well, Can Taylor. I say I know what that is. My dad didn't like things in California, so he's back. Actually, that's bull crap, but check it out. It's a 355. I believe this is the one with the manual, yes. the sticker shields. It's unlocked. Oh, look at that. It's not in the best shape, but it's it's pretty good. <laughs> what do you say? Douche. Douche? No, Taylor, that's obviously Doc. If they put a, if they put an oom out there, douche. <laughs> <laughs> okay, douche 355. Well done. He's got the valve stems on it. Needs a bit of a wash, but, uh, yeah. All right. It is 1.21 in the morning. I'm editing the vlog from today and doing a bunch of emails and stuff. And I was looking around on um, cars.com last night, just browsing, and I found some really cool photos of this guy selling, I believe it was an 08 M5. Um, it's pretty perfect. I don't like the interior trim and the fact that it has a front license plate holder. But the camera work that he did was really spectacular. Okay, so it's got the wood trim. That needs to go. But um, the flip is never going to do this any justice. But it, it just the, ca the quality of whatever camera and lens he used, I can count every little stitch in there. And it's beautiful leather. Something the E39 could never have because it was it's before it. It's too old. You've got a great picture here. You can see the metallic finish in the paint. Um, really nice, really beautiful photos. I wish they were higher resolution, that's as big as they are. So you can see all the stitching there. <clears throat> There's a beautiful shot of the paint finish. Nice black and white of the shifter there. Awesome quad tipped exhaust. Really nice photos. Of course, there's its V10, so that was cool. I rarely save stuff from cars.com <clears throat> listings, but I thought that was one that warranted that. And I've got a whole thing here in my iPhoto library for the M5. I've got 231 photos in here, mostly of mine around town back when we first got it. And the first time, like, there's a phone number on there, but uh, this is the first time we actually saw the car listed for sale. Took a couple photos of it. Looks quite a bit different now. 
after quite a bit of work. But uh, friggin' yeah, cool stuff. Lots of photos, lots of work, lots of time, and lots of money. You remember this? There's what my old ones look like. And then I got the new ones in there because that was all cocked over. Look, can't even read that. Now you can read it beautiful. My iPhoto library contains 13,703 photos. It is absolutely ridiculous. There's probably somebody that has more than I do out there, but I think this is quite a few. And I'm trying to figure out how to go to places when I'm in full screen mode. I guess that's down here. And we'll see how ridiculous this looks after the cross country trip. There we go. And there's Hawaii out there in the middle of nowhere. And uh, you guys are probably very familiar with iPhoto, but you zoom in and it gets more accurate. So there's the state of Colorado and Nebraska, Iowa, all the way over there. And you can see yeah, there's a big gap there. I didn't take any between home and really Toledo. But then for the rest of the trip across the country, we pretty much took a picture every half hour. And out here, you, you had to. It was so beautiful coming through western Colorado. Then there was nothing in Utah until we got here to Richfield and Salina, St. George down here, and there's Vegas. And of course, there's a butt ton in California. But then you can organize by states. And it's ridiculous if we go to California, there's all the cities that we drove through or visited in the state of California, all the way up there. It's been a couple years since I've been up there, but. Yeah, iPhoto is very cool. I don't know if Android has an equivalent where it puts everything on a map. It probably does. But the further we zoom in to San Diego, the more pictures we got. Every one of those is at least one photo. Ridiculous. And there's Julian. There's where we drove out for uh, the awesome roads in Borrego Springs and Julian. What is that backwards? It's 1.37 now. I'm going to wrap this up here. Uh, I got a call coming in now, so I'm going to take that, finish editing this, and talk to you guys tomorrow on Saturday. Good night.